Okay, so you guys might have clicked on this video wondering who the Ink Demon is. And after I watched the new Bendy trailer, uh, I think I have a sustainable theory that might be able to hold itself up in its own way, and it might explain a lot of things from the first game. So I proposed this idea. Henry is the Ink Demon. Let me explain. So throughout the first game, uh, each chapter we see the Ink Demon himself. But where does he emerge from? Where does he come from and where does he go? Well, he comes from an ink puddle. Or just any ink thing. Ink wall, ink ceiling, ink floor, ink toilet, whatever. Anything that has ink. But what type of things are trying to kill us in the entire game? The Butcher Gang, the Searchers, the Lost Ones, and Bendy himself, the Ink Demon. But what do these all things have in common? They were emerged from the ink. Submerged, emerged, whatever. They were consumed by the ink. Allison is a different story. She, she didn't really get anyone except Boris, sadly. But, um, each of these guys try to kill us. But what happens when they do? Well, we're met with this ink tunnel with a light at the end. And due to that, we have time to escape. But what if in the fifth chapter, we didn't escape? Play it by here. So, if you see by this, Henry fell through an ink uh, tunnel thing in the first game before he got to leave. But what if right then was the point at the brink of where he started to lose his sanity and also the point where he was starting to get consumed by the ink? Another thing about the proof. So, in the game, like after you beat the game your first try, you get the little magnifying glass. And with that thing, you can look through it and you can see like invisible ink everywhere. But there's this one room, the ink room, where you get the ink bottle in the first chapter. Behind the boards, uh, it's like a toilet room. Not much about it. No one can get there. Not even Henry. But if you look through it, you'll see a text on the wall. And it's confirmed that only Henry wrote these. But how did he get there? How did he get behind those boards? Well, the toilet is full of ink. I think you know where I'm going from here. By proof, uh, in the third chapter, if we go through the demon route instead of the angel route, we get this picture at the end of the game of Bendy uh, guiding the Butcher Gang to a light. So that's proof that he guides them. He bosses them around, he summons them, leads them, all of that. So uh, it's only the characters that were consumed by ink that try to kill Henry. But what if the reason they're trying to kill him is to stop the loop. But each time they fail. Henry goes through the light and then he gets back into the loop. And they try again and again and again. Until Henry keeps defeating Bendy. But then after the Bendy disappears, who's the ink demon now? Henry. So what if at one point, Bendy decides, no, no more light at the end of the tunnel, close that off. Henry, let me make a deal with you. In 10 years, your daughter, Audrey, I heard this from a different theory. This is how I got my theory. If Audrey, the character we play as in the new game, is Henry's daughter. And I think that's a pretty good theory. I, I think that might be plausible. That would be a good reveal too. So anyway, back to what I was saying. Henry, your daughter in 10 years is going to come here and save everyone, free them from this loop. So let's make a deal. 
you will be able to escape from this loop when that happens. But in return, you have me escape too. Because I'm that small part of you right there. It's small and it seems unimportant, but it's your entire soul submerged into the ink. So you can release it when you wait for the perfect time. And then boom, what do we get? Baby Bendy, who appears in the trailer. So I know this might not be that much proof because Benny tries to kill us a thousand times, infinite times actually, because it's a loop. But he's not trying to kill us. He's trying to keep us out of the loop. But he only has a little bit of time before zzz, Henry goes back into the loop. So why did I have this theory? Mostly because I wanted to find out who the Ink Demon was. And I thought this might be a good idea, plus it would wrap up the entire Bendy franchise in the game. Uh, right now I'm recording this on the 12th, so it comes out in three days, so I'm going to try my hardest to get the video out before the 15th, when the new Bendy game comes out. And I'll see you guys then. I'm not going to play the game, but, you know, I'll, I'll, I'll uh... I'll watch a few videos about it and then I'll make my own theories. But that's just a theory. A bendy theory. And thanks for watching.